Of old was the age when Emil lived, sea nor cool waves, nor sand there were. Earth had not been, nor heaven above, but the yawning gap and grass nowhere. Then the first frost giant fell, his body placed in the middle, where there was only darkness. From Emir's flesh was fashioned the earth, from his blood the billows of the sea, the mountains from his bones, the trees from his hair, the spear of heaven from his skull. Out of his eyelashes the gentle gods made Midgarth for sons of men, and out his brains were the angry clouds, all shaped above the sky. Sun did not know where she had her home. Moon did not know what strength he had. Mundilfari is he who begat the moon and fathered the flaming sun. The round of heaven each day they run to tell the time for man. Though they run not alone, shadows follow and come close. In the east the old one lives in iron wood, and there she bears Fenrir's brood. Skullis the wolf called who hunts the burning bride, but from all of them comes one in particular, the ruin of the moon. He gorges himself on life of doomed man, reddens the gods dwelling with crimson gore. Hot he awaits for the shining moon, so that dark engulfs the light, and weather turns vicious. Over the sea from the east there sails a ship, carrying men and women looking for a new world. At the end of heaven, a giant in eagle skies, Rasvelga sits, they say, and from his wings does the wind come forth to move over the world of men, guiding their path to Iceland. <laughs>